Hey guys, somebody in the forum asked me if I could put all the stickers on my Legacy Megazord and then break it apart and show you each of the Zords in particular to see what they look like and anything that may have popped up, so that's what I'm doing. I set up my ring light, which is a photography light, um, so you can kind of see the gleam of the metal and see that it, it does look really nice, but like I said, there are a few qualms with it and you definitely wouldn't want to throw out your old 93 Megazord anytime soon. For one, it does come with this nice sword, but like I said in the other video, it doesn't fit in the hand. So guess what? My old one gets a sword now. So that's cool. Um, and I'm just going to break them apart one by one and show you some of the cool things and some of the not so cool things. So we will start with this. It's a pterodactyl. Not much to it here, just pretty plasticky, nothing real metallic here. Um, one of the things I did notice is it says 09 Thailand on the very inside, which I don't think you can see. But I was wondering if maybe that had to do with an, a 2009 mold. Because, um, like I said, it does seem very similar to the 2010 version of Megazord. But anyways, that one's pretty straightforward. We'll move on to Triceratops. He does have the metal gun. Um, he has plastic horns, which kind of sucks. Um... And he does not have wheels, so it's pretty basic. But with the stickers, it does look a lot, a lot more nice. And there's that. Next, we're going to go with Sabertooth Tiger, who looks like she has wheels, but actually doesn't. So those are non-working. Um, the gun is metal, though, just like Triceratops. With the stickers, it looks nice, and the things are that soft plastic again. Next up, we'll move on to Mastodon. So the arms break off a little differently on these ones, as you can see. And there were a couple sticker issues here. In fact, I'm noticing one of them now. This covers up a hole, and it's kind of difficult to put on, too. So it went on a little janky-ish. Do that a little quick for you. As you can see, it's plastic right here plastic right here. It's that soft plastic. It's nothing metallic except for the inner workings of the arm. This has metal right here. Pretty much like the other ones you've seen. It's a little tight in there so I won't take it out right now. It doesn't have the bendy thing on top. So the stickers do make it look a lot better. I would stick with this one in the end because it's the best one. But obviously we're all Power Ranger fans and we all need to have this. So I'm sure you'll be getting it anyways. <laughs> Thanks.